I know it's been a while since we last spoke, but something has happened at the mines I've been supervising. No, trust me, you'll want to make time for this. You're looking for something big to keep your museum in business? Well, there's something big on that island. Real big. So many friends. And even my own son are still out there. If anyone can bring this thing down, it's you. It'll be the biggest attraction your city's ever seen. And you can help an old friend. Yes, meet me on the docks at sunset. I hope you're ready for a little monster hunt. Yes, sir. They call him Charles. Half train, half giga spider from hell. We've been planning his demise for some time now, and have nearly everything in order. Just a few people to meet and places to see. Simple errands, you know. <laughs> yes, sir, welcome to Erinirum, the island where miners dig their own graves. Stay close. Charles isn't the only thing to fear around here. There's a train shed at the top of the hill. One of the train operators was killed early on by the beast. So his old engine should be in there. If we can get to it, it could be an indispensable tool on our journey. Stay close. We don't want to be exposed for too long. <laughs> It's locked. Not to worry, we can still find a way in. There's a small shack up the path that might have a key inside. Take this map, I just marked the location on it. See if the key is up there, and I'll look around some more down here. You! Looks like you found it! Open up that door and lead the way! Hey, that's what I'm talking about. She's an oldie but a goodie. I'm going to inspect the train's exterior. Why don't you take a peek inside, see what we got to work with? Well, the exterior is a little rough, but everything looks to be intact. That gun you were looking at wasn't on here when I was evacuated from the island, but it sure looks fun to use. <laughs> 
We can light up Charles with it and take him down before he even sees us coming. Are you ready to take this thing for a spin? You must be the archivist that Eugene told us about. We're happy you came to help us out of this predicament with Charles and that madman Warren. You know, that old train of yours will need some major upgrades if you want to take down Charles. There are some metal scraps in my barn that you could use to improve it. Here's the key to the barn. It's just up a path, but I'll mark it on your map anyway.
jar of pickles locked away inside my pickle cave. I would have gotten them hours ago, but I lost my pickle cave. Someone else on the island might have some lost pickles. I mean, lost picks. And if you can bring me my special jar of pickles, I'll give you all the scrap metal I have. Welcome to Araniram, Archivist Museum person. My apologies. I'm not the best with introductions, but I don't believe either of us are here for socializing. I just so happen to have a little business opportunity, if you're interested. A very special little box of mine is in a rail car in the nearby canyon. But the goons have set up a camp to protect that area, so be careful. Find the blue box and bring it back to me. I'll give you some scraps as payment.
Jean told us we'd have a newcomer soon. I suppose that would be you. There's some scrap metal in the balcony room of my house that you could use to repair and upgrade your train. Here's the key. And although the balcony is right behind me, I'll just mark it on your map anyway. As a side note, talk to anyone around here, and uh, they'll do whatever they can to help. Anyone not wearing a mask, that is. Check out the balcony, and take whatever you can use. Good luck with everything. Look, kid, 
I know you're supposed to be some fancy pants monster hunter, but you can't earn my respect without making yourself useful. One of Warren's goons dumped a locked chest in the yard last night. After beating on it for a few hours, I didn't break anything but a sweat. I got some lock picks, but I don't know how to use them. Here, take them. If you can get that chest open, you'll earn my respect. And I might just give you some scraps to help him. Well, fancy fingers here got the chest unlocked. <laughs> uh, that's an odd-looking piece of junk you found inside there. Bit of a letdown, to be frank. But you earned my respect, so here's some scraps, like I promised. The monster hunter has arrived, I see. This is no ordinary hunt, mind you. We've already tried fighting Charles, but he retreats into the wilderness if he is sufficiently harmed. We believe there may be a way to get Charles to commit to a mortal battle, however. Dispersed around the island are three eggs, locked in the island's three primary mines. Our theory is that putting these eggs in the temple at the center of the island will provoke Charles into a fight to the death. Unfortunately, the mining company owner, Warren Charles III, has placed armed guards inside each mine to protect the eggs. There's an egg in the mine just down the rail. Here's the key to the mine. I've marked the entrance on your map. Flamethrower is an addition to my spider train home defense plan, but as you can see, it is slightly uh, backfired. <laughs> Nearly cooked myself alive in that shed as I was testing it. Shoot dang. I would love to save the shed though. If a uh, flamethrower somehow still works after the fire dies down, well, <laughs> you can take it. I'd assume you're the monster hunter that folks have been expecting, so, uh, a weapon like this could come in handy.
Using the water tank to put out the fire. Pure genius. Woohoo! Here, take old bug spray. Cause of this chaos. I don't want to see it anywhere near here again. Shoot, dang. Thank <laughs> you. 